Yesterday, freaking monsoon season in Seattle. I'm telling you, it's. You ever heard when people say, "Don't want to live in Seattle"? It's like raining all the time. Well, I'll tell you, it's not. But uh, man, it does rain a lot, and when it does, it's... here's the thing. I have to do a lot of commuting. I gotta commute to see GIF, I gotta commute for work, and so I'm out in the rain all the time. And I don't have a car. I wish I had a car. Someday I'll have a car. I've had many, 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 many cars in the past. But I don't have a car right now. I have two motorcycles. One of them, my daily driver. The second one, my old daily driver, which is an amazing bike, but it's kind of under the weather. I've gone through a lot of motorcycle gear over the last four years, because I've been riding a motorcycle every day for the last four years. And I'll tell you, it's, it's expensive. And I try to get away with it as cheaply as I possibly can. Um, my rain pants right now are completely worn through and torn up. Okay, hold on. my rain pants. I don't know if you could tell right here, but on this leg that I'm holding, that's, this is the waterproof part right here. And as you can see, it's completely worn away. It's just a stupid mesh material. It, it, it soaks right through. There's nothing there. And, and the crotch area, I mean, that's, that's completely, completely torn out. It's completely gone. The stitching just coming right up. This is the inside of the leg. I gotta get me some new pants. Quick little jaunt around the corner. Thought I'd pay a quick little visit to my friendly neighborhood. Oh, yeah. That was intense. Look at the stuff they have in there. Look at that poison. Oh man. They took one look at that camera and they're like, I'm gonna shoot you, son. son, 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 son. And I'm like, oh. Oh. It was pretty cool. You gotta see the inside of one of those stores. I don't know, they're not gonna let people bring in cameras, but just go in for yourself. That was, whew, that's some cool, cool stuff. Oh, by the way, I got some pants, some pants. So let's go home and have a look at those and we'll talk about them a little bit because I know how much you wanna know all about my pants. There's a store up here where they sell grass and they say that it gets you high, but I, I don't know how like, grass can make you float up in the air. It's very strange. It's weird. They have things called edibles, like plants. Very weird. I guess that's just like a lot of glassware and stuff. But. So right in there. Isn't that weird? You can't even see in the windows. You know another thing that would be really cool to have for somebody to sell? It's like boots you could wear without having to wear super long socks, too! <sighs> Boo! Just joking. <laughs> Made it back from the store. As you know, I was just going around the corner to get to that Army Navy Army Navy Surplus Store. There you go. Man, 
these boots. Look at in there. You see, I've got some gaff tape on there. It's been there a minute. I don't know, somewhere up in, in here or, or right in here. Really digging on me. Really digging on me. I mean, look at that. Look at that red spot. Obviously, it's not dry and drawn blood, but man, it's really annoying. It was like a little scrap. It was causing me to limp on my way home. I mean, all these people are like, oh, what's wrong with that poor guy? Or, oh, is he hurt? It's like, come on. It's just my boot scratching on me. So let's have a closer look at what I brought home with me. Rain pants. Super cheap. They were like $18.99 or something like that. <laughs> right. It doesn't even say on there what it is. This material, you can hear it. It's almost the exact same thing as those last ones I had, and they started tearing after the first week, so I know these aren't going to last me very long. I gotta think. 20 bucks a week to keep, you know, like, dryish in my legs. Even when I'm wearing the, the rain pants on the freeway, the rain water, it's still, it, you know, it's not the rain falling down on you that gets you real wet. These are okay for that. It's once the water's on the road, then all those cars in front of you, they're just spraying up water like this. just like a cloud. And you don't notice it when you're driving in a car. When you're driving in a car, unless it's pouring down rain and then the visibility gets really bad, then you notice that there's like crazy amounts of clouds of water. But just on a regular rainfall, when you don't notice anything, you don't see it. Oh, on a motorcycle, on a motorcycle, let me tell you, it's like basically a three foot, four foot maybe wall of water. You don't see it when you're driving in a car, but let me tell you, it's there. It's like a wall of water. Whatever. So these are really cheap materials. Buttons in there. If you wanted to make them a little bit smaller around the cuff, you can just fold it in like that. Snap it. Make it a little bigger. Snap it. You've got an elastic waist. You've got a back pocket. It's thin as paper. This is, this is cheap stuff. This is like, these aren't pants. These are just something that you throw on the pants that you're already wearing, which of course I always do. They had some nicer ones. There was these Red Ledge ones, and those were like $80. And then they had Carhartt ones, and those were like $140. And those ones are much higher. They, they almost felt like a, a canvassy material, except for it's actually waterproof. It's the same as the jacket I have up there, which is waterproof. It, it's not perfect. It's not like this. This is like plastic. So the rain hits it, and it just rolls away. That one is water repellent, and it soaks in water, but it's over time. So I can wear that thing all the time, and even though it soaks through, I still stay relatively dry inside, you know, but then I gotta dry it out because it's water soaked into it. And that's what those other kinds would do, but that would be fine for me. I feel like just walking around the city or whatever, a, a pair of pants like that, if you're just working in it, it would stay dry. You know, and the only reason I think my jacket soaks in is when you go up 80 miles an hour with that wind. Here I go, blabbing on about stuff that even I don't care about. So let's look at this. We've got a back pocket. We've got elastic. Pants. And that's all I want to talk about that. Um, okay. 